YouTube family, welcome back, welcome back. Today is a little chilly, rainy day, but we are going back to the Empire Buffet. Got the family right here. Ta-da! Where is Juice? So there cool. he is. We're linking up with Raina today. She wanted to do an, uh, some content. So this is the Empire Buffet out here in Moreno Valley. And uh, I don't know. Raina want to eat like I don't know she wants you know I wouldn't let Raina in a buffet <laughs> they only charge like 11 12 dollars 15 dollars max and she, she gonna come eat all their goddamn food oh did the fishy got rid of water so this place has a lot of fishies last time I was here the the water was running out and they were all like stuck where is the fat one I don't know if she was fat or she was pregnant but there are like a bunch of them. I don't know if they be sleep or what. But let's see. There's a bunch of them. I forgot to show y'all. This is the inside. We're all the way back here. We're right now. Oop. <laughs> so. I think we ate back here once. Where is she? Oh, yeah. oh, okay. I see her. Here we go. Hey, girl. Hey, Raina. Good, how are you? Hi, doggy. Hi, doggy. Am I? Probably because I'm wearing black. Hey, girl. Right, okay, let me show you guys all of the food here. So, of course, we have the we have the dumplings with the soups, and then we have all the fried items like fried wonton, uh, crab ragoon, French toast, shrimp. There's some stretches right there. The donuts, the egg rolls. They also have a hibachi bar over here that you can pick your noodles. What's good, guys? What's good? What's good? What's good? What's good? got his uh, crawfish. Juicy, where's your plate? All right. And then over here we have rice, noodles, broccoli, green beans. We have mushrooms, orange, orange cat, chicken, corn. Um, yep. Over here we have. Up, oh, spare ribs, crawfish, crab, squid, clams, shrimp. Over here is the cold vegetables. So over here we have, uh, you know, we have the shrimp, oysters. I've been eating the oysters from here and people think I'm crazy. But I think those crawfish are cold. They have hot crawfish over there. This is the fruit section and this is the sushi bar. And it's really cheap for only being $15, honestly. I think. I think it's like just that much. And this is the dessert bar. All right, first plate for me. I got some crabs right here. I got some fried rice, some honey chicken instead of the orange chicken, some green beans, and some broccoli. I really like their broccoli here. Mmm. I'm just eating a lot of meat. Yeah. I love orange chicken. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I know. Um, yummy. Yeah, why is the music so loud? I think it's kind of hard to pop over, but it's kind of hard to pop over. She's getting in the pocket. <laughs> what? She's getting in the pocket when she get louder. Okay, dude. That way, boy, people is always louder in the pocket. And now we're just like thugging it out. Oh, I'm looking like weird. What? Mm-hmm. 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 Oh, you're it out. Thugging it out. That's terrible. That's my generation. I need y'all Gen Z's to understand. Back in my days, face ass. Back in my days, face ass. <laughs> Shut up, Javon. Tell me back in my days, face ass. <laughs> I need y'all Gen Z's to know that I'm all of y'all slang. Alpha. You're an alpha? Is that something else? Something, something, yeah. Who's not Gen Z? You're not Gen Z? Oh, okay. She's <laughs> we started a lot of these slang and y'all just repeating it. Okay? Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> the weird twister. This is just the originator. <laughs> Mr. Shush is the original back in my days. <laughs> Go ahead, say it. What are you? Are you you my age, right? How old are you? 33. No. What are you? 27. Yeah, yeah, they That's both in 20s. Matter. How old are you? 29. Oh, okay. What else? <laughs> <laughs> well, damn, Grandpa back in our days. <laughs> I 
Talk about who taught you thugging it out. I've been thugging it out. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Motherfucker, I am the thug. <laughs> I ain't a thug nothing now. Okay. Right. I like five kids. It's a pretty cool Asian spa you found. They have a lot of selection. Uh huh. Yeah. But the one that we went in Texas. The biggest Vietnamese one? Like it was the new one. It's uh -huh. Empire. Not, no, not the Vietnamese one. Oh, I don't like that taste. We went to um, a King Buffet in uh, Arlington. Delicious. They had just opened. When I say everything was delicious, everything was delicious. Like we had the same, like, you know, bread, but it was good. Oh, you know what really impressive the other day? I made Vietnamese spring egg rolls. You need the three pinches spread you gave me. Yeah. It tastes delicious like Vietnam. The spring roll with who? My bánh chén, man. Bánh chén. Bánh chén with like spring garden roll, cooked or fried. Uh, no, right, but she fried it up. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, okay. Taste authentic. With the potato? The egg roll? Mm -hmm. Okay. I didn't make it for you. I, was, I, I really like them. My dad liked them too. Yeah. A lot of people don't understand. I'm like, Vietnamese egg roll is different. I do like Chinese egg roll. Like Chinese egg roll has cabbage and shrimp. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, very basic. Yeah. 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 And now it's just pork, potato. There's just a lot more flavor. I don't really eat pork. Like that. I when, when I think about it, I really don't. <laughs> oh, right. hey, you don't like the chill? Yeah. Extra chill? No, I'm good. You don't like pork chops? Mm. No, no, the, the skinny pork chops. Not, not the, no. like the big ones. You've seen both, right? Yeah. yeah. This is the whole bottle. Mm. Yeah. You know the damn thing? Hey, bro. I did not No. Is it this way? No. Mm -hmm. CCD, you understand what they're saying? Uh -huh. I'm not listening closely. Mm -hmm. Have you seen the one where um, you walk into a Chinese restaurant and the music is still around? Oh, music's really good. Yeah, 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 but that's, that's English. I mean, that's been me. I know, it's been to me. But I found that video before it went viral. Yeah. And I was like, yo, that shit is a hit. I think that Shash is doing it. I think that shit is a jam. Yeah. Mm. So basically, I looked with the Vietnamese guy. And he went to Vietnam to right now, Doug P. So he's going to write me a song. Um, have me write a song. Mm -hmm. And then we'll go to Vietnam next year. Nice. You coming? You said you're coming, right? I'm coming. coming. Let me know today. Yeah. Like their winter break. I'm about to December. This December. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go. Then I talked to somebody, a couple people in the club from and on TikTok. Mm -hmm. All right, let's do it. Oh, really? The pork? Yeah, the ribs are always good. I wish we were sitting there. <laughs> Five from yesterday. No, we like it. If they're not looking, you should give them more. Eat, 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 eat. Good job. So proud of Mr. Stretch. He came so far. A little accomplishment that y'all don't notice. Like, remember when we first moved here? He didn't eat at the buffet with us. Remember when mommy and you ordered that pan of uh, crawfish? Mr. Stretch didn't eat nothing. Now he eating. Pink lemonade? Yeah. Do you guys want any other drinks? I know, I know. Oh my god, I dropped it. How did it flip like that? I know, but how do I get like, it up? My cup. How'd you do that? I, I feel like I need a credit, a debit card, or something like a card, like a business card to slide. No, no, she have it right here. I was just talking about cleaning it up. Should I just leave it instead of clean it? No, nah, I'm good. Oh, sorry, I'm hyper calamari. Marine enemies. Mm -hmm. What the fuck is this? My hair. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We don't care. Mm -hmm. We don't care. We don't care. Middle finger side to side. Like, there's so many songs that I've been singing about like yours. Like, why do you keep singing? Someone, someone was like, I'm gonna party. And I was like, we don't do no party party. I was like, whose song is that? I was like, oh damn, that's my mom. All night long. 
Just party, party. I got a lot of music. I feel like these real like real life rappers like with lyrics. I feel like um like when I people on island now like a lot of them on stage who are like certified really good rappers who got bars for real. And I be like, you got music out? And they be like, no. I'm like, I got so much music out. Appreciate it. I'm like, you better just drop it. You never know. I just got so much music that I haven't dropped that's in my um in my notes. So right now, what you been up to? Oh, I was in Howie Mandel's show. I saw that was really fun. I saw. Oh, you actually... watch America's Got Talent all the time. Oh, that was awesome. Mm -hmm. His podcast was so troll though. He was very unhinged. Yeah. He talks about some of the most ratchet stuff. I was not anticipating that. <laughs> Were you uncomfortable? A little bit. Yeah? Yeah, but I was just like, yeah, they'll do what they do. What was he talking about? You really want to know. Yeah, I do. Y'all right here, tell me. And he, I mean, he talked about it in the show, so it's not like snitching. Yeah, well, he was talking about prolapses and also Audi vaginas. <laughs> yeah, and Audi vaginas? Well, there was, I don't know, he showed a clip of this girl, like, Audi, Audi vagina. Oh, like, uh, uh, inside out pussy. Uh, uh, I call him an inside out pussy. Like, you know how I love? I'm sorry, Jis. No. Okay. What the hell are they on? Yeah. Yeah. It's when the flaps come out. <laughs> so, it was funny because at first he was hating on Audis. Now you and then, bro. And then he starts like, no, 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 I love all sorts of vaginas. So then the chat went crazy and they all started saying hashtag Howie for Audis. And I was like, oh my god. This is Howie like, for Audis? It was so troll. Like, it's so troll. I would be right on the top. I was like, yeah, I know you're talking about. Because I work with a girl. And I used to do bikini wax. Okay. So this is my first time seeing an Audi. And I was like, trying to tuck it in. I was like, this is so weird. You think you're supposed to be on the inside. Why the fuck is it on the outside? And I'm waxing her. I'm like, where is your lips? There's no lips. There's just these outside. And they're just falling out. Like, I'm trying to tuck it in as I'm waxing her. But she must have some, some people love it because this guy ran away with her. They ran away. I worked, so I worked at the nail shop. They weren't supposed to be together. He was engaged to a, he was engaged to another girl in Vietnam. And then they got together in the nail shop. And then they said, fuck it, because the family like, no. And they were trying to say that the girl did voodoo for on him. They ran away. So they disappeared for a couple months. They like ran to North Carolina or something. And I was like, well, he likes that Audi. <laughs> Because I was trying to stuff that Audi back in. I was going to be on They ran away for a couple months and tried to live. I don't know, they didn't survive, so they ended up coming back or whatever. And he ended up marrying somebody else. Well, his wife in Vietnam, and then she ended up finding a guy in Vietnam and marrying him to America. Okay. But that was a lot of drama back then, I remember. Yeah, no, it, it's uh, unhinged. It's really just a surprise. Yes. But now I know, now I know what to expect because I was just asked to go to speeding. Uh -huh. So, you know, they, they told me that, oh, you can just come here just to the speeding and you can leave if you want. But I was like, oh, no, I'll chill and stay. Yeah. And then they, some of the conversations are just so random. So, yeah. Bring on that. Do a podcast. Yeah. So question. You can yeah, talk about eat stuff. one of y'all, uh, crack an egg and just eat it. No. Eat it. Oh. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know, I was just talking. Like, like, you know me, I'm not good at it. Yeah, I'm not good at it. I see the people who just like eat the crap. I know, like, like, you're so innocent. You know, so you're like, oh my god. Now, they had like me, a whole cup full of so just like cracked like, eggs. You would have been perfect. Eggs. You would have added so much like, wow. to the podcast. I, think, I was just sitting there. Oh, it was so funny because I looked obviously uncomfortable. And I had the chat open when I was, you know, on it. And the chat was like, hashtag free Raina. Because I feel like I was kept by my will. That's how uncomfortable I looked. It was so funny. Well, you know what's crazy? Maybe the raw steak. Unhinged people. about that. 
don't know what to do when you're eating. Because even with me, like when I first started, like I talk a lot. So when you're eating, you're hyper focused. You're in your food. You're eating, and like most comedians, like we talk a lot. So when you're eating, we're just running our mouth because it feels uncomfortable. Because it feels strange for it to be such silence. But then people in the background will be like, "Shut the fuck up! Let her do her thing. She can't talk back to you." Oh, they're saying the other. But I understand how because I did see the comments where like, "Oh my god, he's just talking so much, and she's just eating." And like the lady in the back was like, "Just shut up." But I do understand how he feels because I talk so much and he talks so much. It feels like that audience needs them to talk because they're not talking. Because yeah. <laughs> even when we did the ball thing, yeah, they were like, she won't shut the fuck up. Like, like, we need to keep talking. I'm like, I didn't know what to do. I was always talking. So when you kept eating and not saying a word, I'm like, maybe I need to talk for you. You know, people don't understand, like, it's your job to do that. So. Yeah. yeah, yeah. No, I, I get it. That's why, for to me, I don't mind it at all. Oh. Oh. Crap. <laughs> How long? How long we been friends now? Are we friends? We're friends. <laughs> we're, we're friends. <laughs> I'm just thinking how long? I'm just thinking how long? Maybe like a, a year at least. It feels longer than that. That's it. I think it's two years. Two years? Gotta be. I've been here for oh, over three years. Uh, and I met you like a year into. Oh wow. I'm not my Why are you too? I'm gonna run. I don't want it. You eat or eat it. Eat it. You're against it by so quickly. Oh, what? Is this what does Mr. Chef say? Your little sticky fingers. Oh, that's not. Just, oh, uh, that's not. Just, just be stressed. Just be stressed out from the family. And I know y'all be like, how is Juice so different from the rest of the family? Um. Well, cause she's like, exactly. I'm the most talkative in the family. I'm the most funniest in the family. I'm the most coolest in the family. I'm the most shyest in the family. I'm the most coolest in the family. I'm the most competitive in the family. I'm the best in the family. I like noodles. I like noodles. Oh, look, she just reveals to talk to people. You know how to add that back up. I was like, juice. 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 You gotta be active, you gotta exercise because she'll just sit in the house and play Roblox all day and sit on the phone with her friends. So, you know, when we go places, people will talk to Juice and she won't say nothing. She'll go mine. She'll go, what, what's your name? She won't say nothing. She'll look passionate. I was like, Juice, you gotta stop. They're gonna think you slow. They're gonna think you slow. They're gonna think you are mine. They're gonna think you slow. But yeah, let's get into more eating. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and hang up. I have enough time on here. We're gonna enjoy some dinner together here at the buffet. Thank you guys for watching. Bye. <laughs>